Hey, what is up my friends? Liam Davis with video number 66 in my 100 videos in 72 hour challenge. So this is the final video of my second day of the challenge that I've set for myself. And really quickly, if you don't know what I'm talking about, um, on my blog, on my YouTube channel, I've set a goal for myself to make 100 videos in 72 hours, in three days. So that's basically 33 videos a day. And I just wanted to let you know a couple of lessons from that I've learned from my second day of doing this challenge, okay? So there's really, there's three of them. And the truth is, I say there's three, I only know two of them in my head right now, so I really hope I come up with the third one by the time I finish making this video. So the first one, the first lesson that I learned is, it doesn't, things don't have to be perfect. Things just do not have to be perfect because here's the truth. A lot of the times we, we wait for things to be perfect and it's never gonna happen. So when I've been making these videos, I know for a fact that there's been some times that I've made mistakes. I've said something that may not actually be 100% um, accurate. I, you know, I talk so so much that sometimes I'll say something and, and I'll rewatch it and think, oh shit, actually, you know what? Um, I, I may have got that wrong, but here's the truth. I'll, everything that I have said, it is correct when you really think about what I am, the message that I'm sharing. But um, the, the thing is, I'm not gonna go back and reshoot those videos because it's, it, it doesn't matter. Perfection is just, it doesn't matter. All you have to do is actually take action. Forget perfection, you can perfect things along the way. So the second thing that I learned from doing this challenge is to not, re you know, to really not fuck around. Yesterday, I took from 9.30 in the morning up until exactly midnight on the dot to create my 33 videos. Now today, I started at 10 o'clock this morning and it is now 6.35 um, in the evening. So I've, I've completed my goal in almost five and a half hours um, faster than, or I don't know, you know, you do the math for me. You know, five hours faster than I did yesterday. And the reason is I didn't fuck around as much today. I just got to work. And the truth is I actually took more breaks today than I did yesterday but I didn't actually uh, fuck around as much while I was doing my work. So that leads me to thing number three. The third thing I learned was to just keep moving forward. Yesterday, I would create videos, and as soon as I was done creating a video, I would go ahead and just watch it immediately, just to see how it turned out. And again, this goes back to the lesson number one that I shared with you in this video is, Things aren't going to be perfect. Yesterday, I watched the videos just to make sure they're good enough. Today, I am so much more in my power. I know what I'm saying. I know the message that I'm spreading is helping people. And I don't need to go back and rewatch these videos in order to know that they are good. So I may watch them this evening just because I, I enjoy watching my own videos. Um, I don't know if you've ever done this, but when I create my own videos, I actually, I actually enjoy watching them because they make me laugh. They just, they make me laugh. And the more I watch my own videos, the more comfortable I feel in front of the video camera, strictly because, you know, sometimes seeing yourself on camera is weird. Sometimes hearing your own voice is weird. But when you get, the more you get used to it, the more you're going to get used to being out there and making videos, the more you're going to get used to actually taking action and just doing what it is that you've got to do to, um, to build your business. So those are the three lessons from my uh, 66 video, my second day of 100 videos in 72 hours. And I encourage you, if you need to kickstart your business, maybe you have been playing small and you realize now that you need to take more action. You need to play big. You need to start doing something that is going to really, again, like I said, kickstart your business and get it on track, get it in momentum to where you want it to be. And if you are in that situation, I encourage you to come join me and do a 172 hours challenge as well. And look, I know that might be a lot for some people, especially people that work a full-time job. You know, I'm lucky to have all day to be able to create these videos, but I know some people are out there uh, are busy. So maybe you could do a 50 video in 48 hour challenge. Maybe you could do a 25 videos in 24 hour challenge. Maybe you could um, do blog posts instead of videos. Whatever the challenge is, it doesn't matter what it is, as long as it's something, okay? So again, if I've inspired you to, to, um, to do something just like what I'm doing, I think that is amazing and I want to hear about it. So if you're gonna go do a challenge of some sort, whatever that challenge is, set some guidelines for yourself and just set the goal that you're gonna get it done. And you're gonna be so proud of yourself once you do, okay? And when you do, 
I want you to share with me um, in the comment section below or hit the contact button up on my blog, send me an email, let me know what your challenge is and send me a link so I can go check it out because I want to go check out your stuff. I want to go and like your stuff. I want to go and share your stuff. I want to go and leave comments on your stuff. And I want to know that the, the actions that I've been taking have inspired you to take more actions. Okay, so that's it for me today. Video number 33 of day number two, 66 videos down. I'll be back tomorrow with 34 more fresh brand new videos in the next 24 hours and or not, you know, not the next 24 hours now, but from tomorrow onwards. And I will see you then. All right. Peace.